Okay, I'm gonna make a different video today, and it's gonna be how to use Audacity Sound Recorder and Sound Editor. And for people who don't know, Audacity is a sound recorder and sound editor. Okay, first off, you wanna type in Audacity on Google. There, there, or right here. Just like that. And then press on this first one that says Audacity Free Audio Editor and Recorder. Okay, now you have the Audacity Sound page. Don't click on these because they're different versions. Just go to the third download tab up here. And you'll come up to these two windows. For all users, beginners, for beginners and people, for just anybody, this is for all people who want to use it and for advanced users I would just do this one because it's probably easier and I don't really know what which one I did before I just pressed on one of them and I forget what it did so if yours comes up different than mine download the other one if you have windows press on windows here here and if you have a Mac press on Mac I don't really know what those are and then once you download it or install it or whatever it'll be in your desktop or on um, the start thing okay for it pretty much everybody knows what this does it s skips to the start it goes all the way back to the beginning this is to play what you recorded this is to record this is to pause this is to stop and to skip to the end and that's pretty everybody pretty much knows what those are but still okay these are <coughs> oh f well first of all if you have a microphone on which I have right now this is how high you record it like the sound that's gonna be coming out and this is when you play it back I have it all the way up because my microphone's kind of weird Okay, these these pretty much explain the self, but still, well, not really. <laughs> okay, microphone is to record your voice from outside your computer. That's only if you have a microphone. <coughs> Mono out records the stuff that's going on inside the computer. So you'd want to say you want to record music. Say you'd want to say you'd want to record music, you press on mono out, just like this. Yeah, you get the point. I just chose the song because I really like it. <laughs> okay. And you pretty much get what that does. It records the music inside the computer without all the background noises from putting your microphone up to the speaker. Which, if you don't want to download Audacity and it takes up too much memory, you could just put it up to the speaker. But you'd have to be in a really quiet spot and you'd have to like have it in the microphone in the spot where it doesn't echo and stuff okay this is an envelope tool I don't really know what that does because I never needed to use it I never needed to use that 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 or that oh I needed to use this this is a zoom tool it just zooms in on what you recorded time shift multi tool mode draw tool envelope yeah selection tool is what you pretty much always want Okay, and right now, since I'm recording my voice, it's coming up on here. Say these quiet spots, say you don't want them. You get your selection tool, click, drag, unclick, and it'll be highlighted. 
And then just press these scissors and it'll go away. Just like that. And yeah, that's what the selection tool is good for. And this is to paste, copy, trim outside. Oh, silence selection. You don't really need it. Well, just say you wanted that to be silenced. <laughs> there, pretty much what it does. Okay, the effects. These you cannot press on because they're not. You just can't because there's nothing to click on. Press Control A, and then this will be highlighted. Then press on it. Then all these will be darker, and you could use them. Amplify makes it l louder or softer. Bass boost boosts the bass. Change pitch changes the pitch of your recording. Change speed changes your speed. Change tempo changes your speed, but not your pitch. Click removal removes the annoying clicking noise that you have after making after recording I never forget what out what that is echo just echoes your audio plays it back in a certain spot I never forget what that does fade in and fade out fades it in fades your recording going in and fades it going out I never forget what out what those are either noise removal removes the background noises Repeat, repeat it, and so it plays over and over and over again. Reverse plays your recording backwards. Wah wah pretty much just does this. It'll just distort your sound and it'll come out to be like this. Right now, since I'm recording my Right now, since I'm recording my voice, it's...